Sam Damp with Inside Pool Extreme News in Chesapeake, Virginia for the 33rd Annual U.S. Open Nine Ball Championships. Joining me is Seattle, Washington's own Dan Louie, who has just eliminated Rodolfo Lawat in a hill hill battle. Where you are such a fighter. I think you're my new hero. How did you feel? At the, you said that you're still in shock, but you didn't look like you were nervous at all to me. How did you feel? Well, you can't be too nervous, but you try not to shake too much. So I just try to keep that under control. In the very final game at Hill Hill, you almost broke in the nine ball. Did you think it was going? It was heading towards the pocket, and I said, God, I wish I would hit that a little harder. <laughs> but you still fortunately made a ball and uh, ran down and made the 4-9 combo. That was brilliant. Um, and that still wasn't a t it wasn't an easy 4-9 combo, do you? You left yourself on the rail there. It was, could have been tricky. No, I prefer to be off the rail and straight in, but, <laughs> but, uh, but I'm happy to have the opportunity to win. Sure. Sure. Well, um, how did you, I mean, you were never ahead at any point in that match. You were down the entire time. I think the biggest deficit was just a two-game deficit, but you never gave up, just kept fighting. I think I was behind at 7-3 at one point, so I, was, I came from behind. I finally caught him at 10-10, so I did make, make it a little bit exciting. You absolutely did. Well, it was at this very event last year where you gave us all a pretty big scare. Um, you want to talk about that at all? I think I gave myself the biggest scare. Yeah. Well, all I know is uh, I was playing my match, and all of a sudden, I felt dizzy, and uh, it was my turn to shoot. And I tried to get up, and I felt a little dizzy, so I sat back down. I got more dizzy, and next thing I knew, I was on the ground. And then I guess I was out for a minute or two. Then the AIDS car cars came, and then they took me to the hospital, uh, emergency, and um, within about an hour, I had emergency surgery. What did did you did they know what caused it? What happened? Well, all I know is uh, it was internal bleeding, and that's what I lost about uh, probably lost about half of my blood. So that was all in my abdomen. You know, that's where I had that that pain. And um, so um, after losing that much blood, I guess it just caused you to faint. My blood pressure went down, and so they um, so I had a surgery. So they just took out all the blood. You know, that was in my abdomen, and gave me a little transfusion. Gave me a little blood. And next time when I woke up, all, the, all I knew was I had tubes stuck uh, down in my nose and down my throat. It was uh, I says, wow, I want, I want to get this thing out of here. It was kind of like a, a little bit uncomfortable. How long did you have to stay in Virginia for then, last year? I think I was here for, um, well, I was in the hospital eight days, and I, was, I stayed an extra four days to get a little stronger before I could fly back. And you're much stronger this year. Well, I felt pretty good before that happened, but I'm definitely a little stronger than I was after I was, got out of the hospital. Have you had to change anything in your diet or your lifestyle to since that happened last year? Well, you know, at first I was thinking, you know, i got to really watch what I eat. I'm going to eat so good, but, but you know, that didn't last very long. <laughs> pool player hanging out in too many pool halls? Bar food? Oh, yeah, bar food's the best. All right. Well, you look great. You're hitting the ball extremely well. We look forward to seeing your next match. Hopefully it's not another Hill Hill one, but those are the ones that are exciting for the audience, I guess. I don't know. What do you think? Well, you know, that's great for the audience, but it's bad for the ticker. <laughs> do you know who you're playing next? I haven't looked at the board, so I'm going to check that out as soon as I get a chance. Okay. Who's been your toughest opponent so far, probably your last match? Um, well, I've been tough. Ronnie Wiseman was tough the last match, and then... Of course, Luat's always tough, so I guess that was probably the toughest one. That's right. You also eliminated Ronnie Wiseman. Yeah, so that's, um, I guess I have luck on my side. All right. Well, do you have a couple sponsors or anything you'd like to mention? Yes, I'm sponsored by Parlor Billiards and Spirits, and they're located in Bellevue, Washington. Okay. Great. Well, thank you so much. Good luck to you in the tournament. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks again. Dan Louie with me, Sam Diep, here in Chesapeake. And make sure you tune in to InsidePoolMag.com for your up-to-date tournament news, results, and videos. Take care.